Hi guys, there is a question about HBlock and um, HBlock doesn't matter which desktop you're on, so why not? Use the newest, the latest one that you'll have in a few weeks left WM. So it's about HBlock. HBlock is an application that's not from us, but it's you can install it with HBlock. And you see some information, right? But we have our own Arch Linux HBlock. We want to set things the way we want. So it's not the AOR that we use, it's the Arch Linux HBlock Git that we use, our own. So it's um, installed, it says, so fine. I can do an HBlock, Control C, HBlock, and then like any application, it either has a help or it does not have a help. It either has a manual, so man HBlock, or it does not have no manual entry for HBlock. So it's that way that you read everything and say, okay, what's important, what's not. And one of the things we want to figure out again, after years of usage already in HBlock and lots of versions, which is now 3.2.3.1, is um, does it still make backups like it used to, right? So there's an output file in the header, footer, sources, A, deny list. We have our own file, a deny list and a allow list. So you can put in URLs that he thinks you shouldn't go to, then you are uh, clearing some of these URLs. And I've done that already. And that's why I have an article age block thing. So it's already changed a little bit. Um, so didn't encounter any backup or anything like that. But there was, there used to be a backup, I think. Let's see if we can type minus B if my memory serves correctly. Illegal option minus B. <laughs> so that's possibly the reason why the user says, hey, this is still doing it, right? Uh, of course, we can't make backups. It's the way it is. It's uh, how it's um, created by the designer. Maybe just switched name that's possible as well. Um, so let's have a look. Template and wrap and comment C. No, okay, R, F, C, suppress any errors, color version. No, I don't see anything like it. If you want to explore more, what do we do? We do an H block, right? We do H block. I'm not sure. Let's have a look. What did I do, right? What did I do? Um, yeah, thank God. So I put in the URL of the user. So we actually go to the website and maybe in there, often in the commits from time to time, we can also already see that backup is no longer possible or something like that. Some communication about backup. But here there is no mention of the word backup. Usage, template disabled. That's interesting to know. Um, so like I said, the commits, the commits, the commits, the commits, 61 tags, here are the commits. We see merge and remove threats, intel, list, false positives, standalone, sprout, Nordic list, easy list. So these are all lists of people that say those are bad URLs, bad companies, right? Keep away from those. And he's added that to the list. I'm not seeing anything that suggests that the backup support is gone. Issue two, append to instead to release both parallel downloads or block list closed. And then we can type here backup, right? Making time stand backup of even before overwriting it was 2016. So that's not it. And this is how you approach these things. You can you go and have a look if this is still available. I can't find it. Maybe just for well stop doing it and altogether because if I we can always check right. We go to number three, Control Alt F, and we type Arco Linux H block. And we get links. Use H block to improve your security. So it used to be it used to be there it was minus B. 
So it seems that the minus B thing is, uh, is not available anymore. What is, however, interesting, let's have a look, is the way how it works, right? It says, um, let's, well, we we do that, right? It's our way of thinking. We have an H block folder with an allow list and a deny list. And the allow list, we've added analytic Google in there, a marketing platform Google, so the Google Analytics thing that we can actually go and have a look at it. Otherwise, it will be blocked if we don't have this in there. And that would be a pity for me, at least. So I guess um, to answer the user at this point in time on Discord, I think hblock minus b is not existing anymore since we get the message. Does not exist, right? Yeah. So let's do another clear. So it's at the top of the page, minus b. Maybe change the number, either the, the switch, I don't know, maybe uh, something else, but um, I think that's gone, which means, which means that if you go to the computer, to the file system, and PC, and then H block, sorry, uh, hosts, of course, hosts is the file that's gonna open and change. And it's gonna be, oops, oops, and oops, oops, here it is. This is your hosts, local hosts, Eric system, and so on. That's the general thing that we all have. And once you enable it, once you enable it, Control Alt E, we have the H block inside Adblock's tweak tool as a privacy option. Once we enable it, Everything kicks into gear. Databases get updated. It's a long list in the terminal that's going to be added to this guy over here, the hosts. And now, voila, there it is. I'm only hoping now that he automatically created. So all these rubbish websites are now zero, 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 which means it's not going anywhere any of these tracking websites and all that rubbish website you check out the names it's incredibly long we have now protection over 280,000 websites right we won't get any rubbish anymore and that's why we love hosts and well sorry the age block which goes into the hosts here let's have a look this is now enabled did he create automatically a host file or not? It's a not, I think, since, uh, let's go back here. There is this one, that one. So I don't see anything uh, relevant or backup for the host file. So if you unlock it, and that's of course the advantage of Arclex Tweak Tool again, Let's see what happens if we say we don't want HBlock anymore. We don't want HBlock anymore. Privacy off. And we get back everything that used to be there. So we make a backup for it, right? So that's, um, it's cool. But as a developer, I will make an issue on the website asking them why that's gone or if that's gone or did it change by name or anything like that. So things like this, you can do it yourself, right? You can ask the developer of HBlock what's going on. We used to have this very politely, of course, and ask for more info. All right, so my suggestion to you for this time is use HBlock since or, or sorry, use ATT since ATT does make a backup and then with that backup, you can actually put everything back. All right. Just checking something here. Okay. Then I'm out. Cheers.